Jaguar I-Pace, electric car pioneer discontinued. Production of this model will end in December 2024. Jaguar Land Rover announced this month that its luxury brand Jaguar would discontinue five of its six models, including the all-electric Jaguar I-Pace. According to the company CEO, Adrian Mardale, via Automotive News Europe, production of the Jaguar XE, XF, and F-Type will end in May, while production of the E-Pace and I-Pace at Magnastair, a contract manufacturer in Graz, Austria, will cease in December. This means that for the time being, the brand will only have one mid-size SUV model left, namely the Jaguar F-Pace. Jaguar I-Pace 2018-204 the Jaguar I-Pace model was launched in 2018, and after peaking with more than 17,000 global sales in 2019, the model has gradually faded. Cumulative sales are expected to reach around 70,000 by the end of 2024. The reason behind this radical change is Jaguar's upcoming transition to an all-electric luxury brand with three new models based on the Jaguar Electrified Architecture J platform. The current models also have near zero profitability. The Jaguar I-Pace, launched in 2018, has not sold well, although it has seen a slight increase in the last two quarters. In Q2, sales reached 1,923. In the first half of this year, sales reached 3,890 per units globally, or almost 12% of Jaguar's total volume. Those volumes are relatively low, even by luxury brand standards. The lack of significant upgrades to specifications including battery and range and stiff competition in the crossover ASUV segment, including the Tesla Model Y, have led to a gradual decline for the Jaguar I-Pace. Over the past six years, Jaguar has sold 66,750 I-Pace EVS globally. By the end of 2024, the volume could reach 70,000 units and will continue to grow. The company will continue to sell all discontinued models as long as supplies last and will continue to service these cars, including combustion engine cars, in the upcoming EV era. News of the end of the Jaguar E-Pace and I-Pace is another blow to Magna Stare, which previously lost production of the Fisker Ocean. Automotive News Europe also notes that the contract manufacturer part of Canada's Magna International had hoped to produce an all-electric Ineos Fusilier model, but this has been delayed. Production of the BMW 5 Series ended in 2023, and now Magna Stare only makes a few cars, the Mercedes G-Class, BMW Z4, and Toyota Supra. Jaguar Land Rover Electrification Meanwhile, Jaguar Land Rover is set to introduce six new electric models in the next three years, three Jaguars and three Land Rovers. The first is an E version of the Land Rover Range Rover next year. The first electric Jaguar is also due in 2025. It will be a four-door GT built in Solihull, England.